Every day we continue the search for a solution to Syria's tragic conflict. But faced with the vetoes of other powers at the UN, we have not yet succeeded. In July, on the Jordan-Syria border, I met families fleeing the fighting, mothers with children who'd walked for days to escape oppression and murder. As of today, it is a serious failure of the United Nations Security Council that we cannot resolve the crisis that has caused those families to flee. But we do help to lead the way in providing the food and shelter they need, documenting the human rights abuses they have endured so that justice can one day be done, giving equipment to Syria's opposition that will save lives, and preparing for the day after Assad when Syrians can at last have a democratic and peaceful future.